Hey everyone, my name's Erin, I use they them pronouns and I'm a mechanical engineering student at the University of Bristol and today I'm just going to show you what it's like to live in Bristol Uni's West Village. So Bristol residences are split into villages, uh, the West Village contains both undergraduate and postgraduate accommodation so it kind of suits everyone. There are also loads of different options as to where you can live, uh, so I've got friends living in self-catered, there are also catered halls, some people prefer that. I've got an ensuite room for example, um, but again like people have shared bathrooms and kind of standard bedrooms. And then there are also single sex flats available, so really uh, there's a variety of things to suit different people's needs. I live in Harbour Court, which is for postgraduates, and I've got loads of space in this room. I've got a really lovely, cosy double bed. My pin board is great if I need to put anything up, uh, particularly if I need to remember something. My plants and me um, love having a window. I've got loads of light. Let's have a peek in my ensuite bathroom, uh, which is surprisingly spacious and really clean. Uh, the desk, probably the most important part, particularly for a student. Again, really big. Um, I've got loads of space here in the drawers and more storage up here, uh, more than I could possibly need really. And then I've got a really big wardrobe, you know, plenty of space for my clothes too. So pretty much everything I could need as a student. But not only that, I've also got some stuff in the kitchen too, so shall we go check that out? So here is the kitchen. Uh, my flatmates are in here already. Hi guys! It's really spacious in here, we love chilling out in the evenings. This is a self-catered flat, so we've got all the appliances you need. A big old fridge and freezer, and we've got an oven and a hob, and then kind of the convenient little bits too, so a toaster, kettle and microwave. Actually, all of the halls have laundry facilities within them. We're really fortunate and it's really convenient to have the tumble dryer and the washing machine in here too. That's pretty much my whole flat. Harbour Court is about a five minute walk away from the very iconic Bristol Harbour side, which is an amazing place to go for a walk or a run. Just up here, we've got a supermarket, loads of restaurants and bars, which is a lovely place to go with your friends, particularly on a hot day. Behind me is Brunel House, which is another one of the self-catered halls in the West Village. As you can see, it's absolutely gorgeous. We're just about to head inside to talk to my friend Finn. It's actually really cosy in here, um, but what else do you love about living in the West Village? Sure, yeah, so apart from obviously the accommodation, um, I'm a 10 minute walk from uni, which is really handy. We're really close to Brandon Hill. Oh, sure lovely. You know that. Yeah, which is like a really nice green space with loads of great views over Bristol. So a great place to hang out. Yeah, it's really gorgeous being there, particularly in the summer. Um, what kind of stuff do you do in the evening? Sure, yeah, so again, just at Park Street, um, you'll find the Triangle, which is where most of the student clubs are based. Um, but yeah, there's also loads of bars and restaurants, so a great place for a night out, really. Yeah, I've had a lot of fun up there myself. Um, we're about to head up to Clifton Hill House, but can you tell us a little bit about Clifton Village? Cool, yeah, so Clifton Village, you'll find loads of um, independent shops and cafes, that kind of thing. Um, so a great place to take friends and family if they come to visit. Mm, that's a good point, actually. It's really cute. Thanks, Ben. We're going to head up to Clifton Hill House now. Um, but yeah, cheers for talking to us a bit about West Village. Cool, yeah, no worries. I'm just in the garden outside Clifton Hill House. Parts of this building date back to the 18th century and you'll find some of the other residences in the West Village have a lot of history behind them too. Let's take a look inside. So every hall of residence has its own security team, but here in Clifton Hill House is actually the base of the residential life team for the West Village. They're basically there for all of your kind of student support needs, uh, be it locking yourself out of your flat or something wellbeing related too, so they've really got your back. This is also a great space to show you the canteen, um, because Clifton Hill House is a catered residence, this would be where you're eating most of your meals. For convenience, you've also got a pantry in your flat, which is great for a midnight snack. One of the great things about living in the West Village is its proximity to the Students' Union, which is a hub of activity, sports and social events. It's really fun hanging out in the bar and it even contains a swimming pool and a theatre. I've loved living in the West Village and I've really enjoyed showing it off to you today because picking out accommodation is a really exciting part of coming to university. But don't worry if you don't get one of your preferred residences because wherever you live, I'm sure you'll make some amazing friends. It's been great hanging out with you today. Don't forget to check the university's website for more information on the accommodation we have available and also check out the videos for the other villages too. See what's on offer and find the right place at Bristol for you. Thanks for watching.